partial fractions in this video we discuss the heaviside cover up method for non repeated linear factors instead of the conventional method for partial fractions uh, we explain this method uh, by giving some examples example 1 we take a proper rational fraction of this form here we see that the denominator of this fraction has two non repeated linear factors we apply the heaviside cover up method to resolve this fraction into its partial fractions as we see that there are two factors in the denominator so this fraction will be resolved into two partial fractions uh, now we explain this method we place x minus 1 is equal to 0 that is the first uh, factor x minus 1 equal to 0 and we get x is equal to 1 now we replace the value of x by 1 but not in the factor from where we have obtained it do remember that we don't replace the value of x in the factor from where we have obtained the value of x uh, likewise again we put x plus 2 is equal to 0 and get x is equal to minus 2 again we replace x by minus 2 but not uh, in the factor x plus 2 because we have obtained the value of x to be minus 2 from x plus 2 so this is the heaviside cover up method now we simplify uh, these fractions and we get the result example 2 uh, we take uh, a proper uh, rational fraction of this form here we note that this denominator has three non repeated linear factors we apply the heaviside cover up method to this fraction uh, as we see that there are three non repeated linear factors so this fraction will be uh, resolved into three partial fractions now we apply the heaviside cover up method we place the first factor uh, x minus b is equal to 0 and get x is equal to b now we replace the value of x by b but not in the factor from where we have obtained the value of b that is here x minus b will not be replaced by x is equal to b again for uh, we come to the second fraction and put x minus uh, c is equal to 0 for second fraction we put second factor is equal to 0 and get x is equal to c now we replace the value of x by c but not in the factor from where we have obtained the value of c uh, for a third fraction we put x minus d is equal to 0 and we get x is equal to d again we replace x by d but not in the factor x minus d because we have obtained the value of x is equal to d from this factor so this is the heaviside cover up method for a fraction with three linear non repeated factors in the denominator so we simplify this uh, uh, fraction and get these partial fractions